The apostrophe in this passage is in the final two lines. Uh, the context is where uh, Macbeth is imagining that he sees a dagger and then uh, tries to grab the dagger, speaking directly to it. And that's where we see the apostrophe when he says, let me clutch thee, thee being the dagger itself. Uh, and furthermore, I have thee not, yet I see thee still. Uh, well, what purpose is the apostrophe serving here? First and foremost, it highlights the mental anguish um, or emotional distress that Macbeth is feeling um, because he actually envisions a physical knife. More than that, however, he speaks to the knife as if it's a person and will respond to him. Remember, in his mind frame, he believes it's actually there floating. Um, moreover, let's take a look at what he does say, and in particular, this last line. I have thee not, yet I see thee still. Um, now, this, is, this antithesis here is actually highlighting the mental conflict that Macbeth is having. He's on his way to go murder King Duncan, and he's still wrestling with that moral quandary. That, that conflict, that moral quandary that he's feeling, is highlighted right here when he speaks directly to the dagger. He can see it, but he can't grab it.